everybody and welcome i i am extremely thrilled and delighted you know to be here and doing it with all of you because i feel that the only way that we can make we can come out of this mess so how many of you agree with me that we are actually in a health mess these days right and if we have to come out of this mess this is one very very important pillar which can take us out from this health mess so welcome everybody i promise you these two and a half days are going to be full of knowledge are you are going to hear from all these esteemed speakers which will make you think which will make you make a plan for your own health and which will make you live a much 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 more healthier life so welcome everybody this interesting fact about functional medicine is you know that we have come back to what hippocrates said father of medicine let food be thy medicine and medicine be thy food right so it's been a full circle but i think high time we come here and what really excites me is that we are not alone today who is talking about all of this a very important thing which is happening parallelly which tells us that we are on the right side is the policies i am sure all of you know that 2022 glyphosate now is banned in india of course i know from getting banned to not being used is going to be a journey but at least the message now from the government also is loud and clear that pesticides are creating harm glyphosate which was you know introduced in 1990s was thought to be better than the ddts and the old pesticides but we have now found out that it is worse and i think india being the diabetic capital or the capital for heart diseases one of the huge reasons behind it is glyphosate and other pesticides and toxic materials which we are using and introducing in our system through food through breathing through water every day in and out this is not all another extremely good news which i think we all know about is 2023 has been declared a year of millets does it excite you i like the smile on your face mahesh because i was so happy i can't tell you last 6 years since i've come into functional medicine and i think most of you who are here know that i was a diabetic had lot of health problems was going through a very tough patch when i decided to come into functional medicine it was a huge challenge uh, to tell people to quit wheat or to decrease the quantity of wheat and introduce millets in the diet and imagine now worldwide 2023 is being celebrated as the year of millets we all know india grain which we used to do used traditionally was millets and i think india is the largest producer of millets in the world and uh, i think it is not only about millets important thing is that there is a messaging going around from the top also now the government the officials they are realizing now that you know this is the way to go i love modern medicine i am an allopathic doctor right and uh, of course whatever i am doing i am doing because of that but the interesting fact which we all have to realize you know all patients doctors because we all are human beings so all human beings have to realize is that allopathic medicine helps when there is emergency when there is an accident right but these lifestyle diseases they it takes about 15 to 20 years to for them to manifest and therefore they cannot go away at a click of a medicine and that's fair lifestyle plays a huge 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 role you know when we look at mark hyman who heads the functional medicine department of cleveland clinic um, this also tells us that institute like cleveland clinic also sees a lot of value with functional medicine so this is scientific this is there to be there now this is the future of healthcare and future of medicine 
and uh, i welcome all of you who have decided to be the torch bearers in this field and you know join this in the early days but there also if you look at him and one of the very important stories he shares is and a program which they did with church uh, with the church wherein just by changing lifestyle they changed thousands of people's lives and they lost weight and they did not have any migraines and their diabetes were got controlled only through lifestyle changes so friends what i'm trying to tell you is this is really powerful this is the thing to stay and this is the space where health is going to happen in a big 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 way in the coming years now if we look at the research of 2022 and if we look what has come up two important points which have really been focused on is till date i think we all are aware we used to talk about antibiotics destroying our gut ppis or statins destroying our gut right but 2022 lot of research has come on polypharmacy so all of you here please raise your hands all of you please raise your hands please perfect now if you know somebody who has any lifestyle disease please take your hand down oh there is not even one hand up imagine so everybody today or most of us are having pills in the morning and you know when we see patients we all know that they come with a list of 5 7 10 medicines which they are taking one for this disease two for this two for this right and now research is showing that this polypharmacy is not helping us come out it is taking us even deeper into the dipshit second research which is popped up most in 2022 is role of not only prebiotics and probiotics but symbiotics and postbiotics and how they can influence our gut and of course new to nature molecules which we are taking inside our body functional medicine is the closest which is looking with a deep lens on this and i think the first thing we all do with our ourselves and our patients is we help them first acknowledge these molecules and take them out of their lifestyle right so this has been the major search area people are searching about leaky gut leaky brain how this has really impacted us and i think the understanding about immune system has gone much much deeper than what at least i studied in my medical school right and so therefore with this introduction you know i will want to invite everybody to just listen very carefully make their notes and we all should come together and make india a healthy country my introduction will not be complete till i thank my sponsors who without whom this conference would not have been possible so marka a excellent product they have come out with we all know we are 70% water even more than that and therefore having good water to drink which is structured and with gels with our body is extremely important nextra nutri neuron jivam health trex genex grow up autoimmunity care trex gen pharmaceuticals lifeline diagnostics fmd nutra wins and vita one so thank you all sponsors for supporting us for this conference thank you all speakers for being here and sharing your wealth of knowledge with all of us and most importantly thank you all the participants for being with us in this journey where health is seeing that dynamic change and we are all excited and looking forward to be healthy thank you yeah thank you